Hello, it is me, Mrs. Penny. Uh, Miss Bookman asked me to make another baking video, but with my face this time. So here it is. Today we are making bread, lizard bits, lizards made out of bread, bread lizards, baby lizards. So um, I already made the dough. It's been sitting and proofing, rising, whatever you want to call it, for about an hour. So we're just going to lift this up. It grew a lot. Ooh, look at that. This is my favorite thing to do with dough. You go like this, you go. Ooh, and it deflates like a balloon. See, I feel like you can't see the counter and my face at the same time, but... The dough is the really interesting part, and I think you've seen enough of my face, so... There we go. Much better. Um, anyways, let's tip out the dough. Let's think about how many lizards we can make out of this. Let's weigh it. 1,025 grams. I think we can make five lizards. So 1,025 divided by five. 1,000 divided by 5 is 200, 25 divided by 5 is 5, so each lizard should be about 205 grams. I'm going to have the head over here, and then I'm going to attach all these little friends over here. So we're gonna do a five strand braid over here. This one. And then... Ah! In the middle. And then this passes over here. Hmm. Okay, I hope you can see okay. So, I'm gonna cross, no, cross my arms. So, this goes underneath this one. This goes all the way to the side and this one goes to the middle. Okay, and then this second piece over here crosses over the middle one. So, this goes under like this. Okay. Over. Okay, I'm getting into the groove here. Is that right? Yes. All right. This is looking pretty good. Except for this head piece over here. Behave, please. Then we have these two little dudes, and these are going to be the legs. Alright, I have my first three lizards here. I'm going to put in their little eyes to press all the way to the bottom so they don't pop out while they're baking. So, here's his little chocolate chip eyes. Put my little nostrils in there, poking it all the way to the bottom. Look how cute. Okay. Let's do the other ones. All right. And then the last thing we're going to do before we do the final rise is to scramble an egg and put an egg wash on. So an egg wash is just when you brush an egg over the dough and 
this is what gives it that really nice shine and gloss and golden brown color when it's in the oven. So it doesn't affect the taste, but it makes it look really nice. And that's why it is an important step. All right, this is all done proofing and it's just about ready to go into the oven. All I'm going to do is give it one last egg wash and then we're gonna sprinkle some turbinado sugar on it. I really like turbinado sugar because it doesn't melt in the oven and it kind of gives treats a nice little crunch. I am really excited. Look how beautiful these are. Oh my goodness, they're so pretty! Yum, and they smell really good too! I'm really excited.